People jammed the streets of Manila for the funeral of Benigno Aquino, the recently slain opposition leader. As the cortege passed by, the mourners shouted anti-government slogans and waved flags in a show of support for Aquino's ideas. The funeral procession lasted some ten and a half hours, edging through an estimated crowd of two million. They gathered along the streets, waiting for hours to catch a glimpse of the man who was President Marcos's only serious political rival. The crowds were the largest seen in Manila since Pope John Paul's visit over two years ago. As the procession marched, a torrential thunderstorm broke out. Lightning struck a group of mourners sheltering under a tree. One man was killed and 11 others were injured. When the storm hit, the funeral cortege was already several hours behind schedule. The funeral mass was celebrated by Cardinal Haim Sin, a close personal friend of Aquino. In his eulogy, the Cardinal declared Aquino hadn't died in vain. He said the death could unite Filipinos in their struggle for democracy. Aquino was finally laid to rest in Manila's Memorial Park. But his power is likely to remain. With the circumstances of his death still in question, Aquino will almost certainly remain a rallying point for opposition to the Marcos regime.